Well, hello everybody, it's me, Tri-State EDC, with a little white box from Billy! Uh, Billy is a YouTuber, he's got a channel, it's called... Future Me? Thank you. Billy, thank you so much! Uh, this is for Trevor, he had to send it to you. Yes, he did. So, Trevor Crystal, viewer of the channel, you know him, you love him, he's in the chat. Apex Alchemy, by the way, that's Billy's channel. Sorry, Billy, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Um... He won this in a giveaway, and now Trevor is giving it to me to give away again. I don't even know. Let's open the box. That's right, little white box, baby. What are we going to use? What are we gonna use? Um, mom, uh, you know, let's use this. This is the, uh, Sever- Ooh, oops. The Winter Blade Guys Severin. I just got this in for review. It's sick nasty. Um, let's, there's a lot, there's a lot. Ooh, there's a lot of tape on here. Great knife, by the way, the Severin. Uh, pre- Hello? Pre-orders are closed. Unfortunately, there'll probably be a big fat drop of these at some point in the future. But, uh, it's a sick knife. Sick knife, dude basically reinvented the uh, the access lock. Kaiser box? That doesn't make much sense. I'm a little confused. Nothing left in here. Goodbye. See ya. See you later, stinky. What do we got? What is this? Screws? Kaiser? Kaiser? Kaiser paperwork? What the hell? Oh my god. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Kaiser paragon. It's a Kaiser Paragon, everybody. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what I was expecting, but this wasn't it. I'm dumb. It's fine. Yeah, okay. Yeah, the, uh, Jesus. Uh, we have looked at this on the channel a few times on live streams. Oh, wow. Uh, I've never seen it in person. I've never touched it with my own hands. Wow, that's ridiculous. Uh, where do I even begin? First off, pocket clip's about three quarters of a mile long. Giant baloney knit pivot. Nice touch. Uh, 154 cm on the blade, just like two inches of blade sticking up closed. It's ridiculous. Uh, we have a, uh, a radiator grill going on here. Just two little jimps, just two. A swoop, a big flipper tab with jimping all over it. More two swoops, two swoops here. Some big old cog, cog wheel style jimping back here. Massive micarta backspacer, really nice micarta all the way around. Stainless liners, thicker than a damn snicker. It weighs half a pound. Uh, I was not prepared for this this morning, but okay, we're gonna roll with it. Spider Compare 3, uh, for a size comparison, it's massive in comparison. Tactile Knife Co. Rockwall, once again, yeah, it's massive. That's a very substantial knife. Uh, do you know? It, it is. It just is. That's a big boy. That's a big boy. So we have a flicking hole and a flipper, but we'll use the flipper. Whoa! <laughs> What the fuck? Sorry. Oh, sorry. This is the mini Paragon. Not the full size. Not the full size. This is the mini. There's nothing miniature about this. Are we... See Hello? Kind of a mirror stonewash finish on the blade. Made a hell of a noise. Lockup is solid. So we have a, a triple compound ground recurve Tonto. Drop point? You know? You know, uh, you know, the shit that shows up around here never ceases to amaze me. What in God's name is this for? Skinning sharks? It kind of looks like a shark. Open size comparison, Spyderco Pair 3, yeah, much bigger. Uh, tacked on to rock wall, oh uh, yeah, much bigger. Big surprise there, kids. I, how is this the mini? What is the full size? Future me, if you can find the full size, give me some specs on that B. It has to be 12 inches long. Jesus Christ. Wow, yeah, that's something else, man. Uh, ergos. Ergos in hand. I gotta be honest with you. Feels great. Really nice ergonomic lines. Nice hook back here. So it locks you into place. Choke back. Easy four-finger grip. No problem. Thumb in that. We got a thumb ramp right here. Locked in. Locked and loaded. Ready to skin a full-grown bull shark. With only my pocket knife in hand. Okay? My carter probably wouldn't do so well in seawater, but 
it's a price I'm willing to pay. Yeah, that feels fine. If it, honestly, it's very comfortable. Nice, nice uh, texture, nice grip from the micarta. Um, you can kind of fingertip trigger pull it if you want to choke up. Otherwise, I wouldn't. Uh, pinch, pinch grip, pinch grip. You know, not really. Uh, thirty five. It's just the look. The blade is six miles thick, and the handle is a toothpick. In comparison, like it, the 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 size, the juxtaposition, juxtaposition. I'm good at English, is mind blowing. Mind blowing. What? So yeah, pinch grip. You know, it works, but not more than thirty percent of the day. Twenty five thirty. It's a little awkward. Uh, wild action. Then I guess uh, running on ceramic bearings. Yeah, it's a guillotine, dude. <laughs> yeah. Oh, detent's solid. Really nice detent. You kind of need a detent that strong on a blade this big. Otherwise, it's not going anywhere. It's just going to flop out. Damn, reverse flick? Flipper? Thumb flick? Yeah. Works great. Kaiser does good work. What are you going to do? That is a dynamite. Oh, detent. <laughs> eh. Wow. Yeah, dude. Absolute guillotine. Just closes. Acoustics are nuts. Really loud. <laughs> Makes a good noise. It's kind of satisfying, honestly. I kind of want to take on a battalion of trolls or orcs. Whatever. Mythical creatures. Myth mythical bad boys. So I'm going to fight them. I'm going to fight them off. Wow. Well, 154 cm, again, triple compound ground, Japanese Tonto recurve drop point is the blade here. Uh, really tall grind, relatively thin blade stock, and it is Kaiser. They do a good job with their edges. I don't know what the condition of this is, but we're going to see if it cuts. I bet you it will. By the way, future me, how much is this thing? It can't be that, like maybe 100 bucks. How much is this? Let me know. We have made it. To the front cover of the Crate and Barrel catalog. I thought the day would never come. Uh, I'm so sorry. Yeah. <laughs> oh, she'll cut. She'll cut with the best of them. Yeah, nice, thin. Now, it's it's interesting. It's a compound grind, right? But it's just a... Th is it hollow? I can't... A re if it is a hollow, it's real subtle. Real subtle hollow in the middle. Not sure what's going on back here. Flat grind at the tip. It's bizarre. But I'll be damned if it doesn't cut. Yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, sure, dude. All day. You know, if a pair of three or, you know, a normal size knife isn't quite cutting it for you, check, take a look at the mini Paragon. Yeah, I don't know. The worst thing you get out, that could happen is you get arrested for carrying a weapon of mass destruction around town. That's something else. The uh, Kaiser Mini Paragon, we will be giving this away. Chances are it will have already been given away on the big Christmas giveaway. Sorry if you missed it. If you were there, congrats if you won. Uh, you probably already received this by the time this video goes live. But uh, hot damn, man. You know, not something I would seek out. Not something I would go and spend my own money on. But having it in hand... It's kind of a fun novelty knife, but it works really well. If you like the way it looks, yeah, sure. Uh, I will leave links down below where you can pick one of these up for yourselves. Again, I'm sure it's relatively affordable. It's Kaiser, built really well. Thank you, Billy, Apex Alchemy. Subscribe to him. And thank you, Trevor. Love you, dude. Thank you for donating this to the giveaway. It's nuts. It's nuts. So someone will get a kick out of it, I'm sure. <laughs> But that is it. Leave a like, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Become a channel member, Patreon member. Hit me up on Instagram, TikTok, Threads. I'm out there. We'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye now.